Uh, hi everyone, and uh, uh, yes, I have a lot of good memories from my uh, first participation here, and uh, for my program, I think it was also a good idea to change a bit uh, my first uh, part of the season. So I'm happy to start here, and uh, yeah, it feels uh, special to be here again ten years after. I hope the legs will be better, and uh, it's always special to start the season here and uh, with the heat and the atmosphere is uh, really different than uh, in Europe so I really enjoy to be here and looking forward to, to race. How confident do you feel then? You have much more experience now since 2014. Do you feel like you can go the full distance this, this time around? Yeah, for sure. The last 10 years uh, was uh, fast. Uh, uh, I remember uh, I came here and I asked a lot of questions to the the guy who has uh, more experience and now the young guys come in my room to to ask me uh, some advice and uh, yeah it's a uh, it's strange but uh, I really like it and uh, we we have a good team to to enjoy the race to to try to to win uh, something even if we don't have any pressure now because uh, the women's won the race and uh <laughs> but no that's no, nice and uh we were happy for them and we 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 want to enjoy the race. Really without making it awkward, how do you rate Luke here and the other Australian riders in the group Yeah of course Luke is uh one of the favorites I think uh uh we know that uh, the Australians rider they are really on a good shape when uh, we we come here we know that so He's used to to ride uh, in the heat, and uh, I think he's uh, he have a good shape. He he's just uh, won his uh, national championship, so uh, yeah, we will try to to do our best and uh, to enjoy the race. Do you see yourself as one of the favorites? Sorry. Do you see yourself as one of the favorites? Do you come here oh. as a result yourself? Oh, I have no idea. Uh, <laughs> favorite, I don't know, but <coughs> for sure I'm motivated to to do my best. Um, you know, you never know how you feel uh, during the first race of the season. Uh, it will be the first big effort. And also, like I said, with the, the heat, is, uh, you have to be careful. So, yeah, I think uh, it's an important year for me to try to come back on my best level. And uh, I will give my best. So I have no stress. I uh, just want to enjoy it. Yeah, I feel good. I feel relaxed, and uh, I had an easy winter, you know, without uh, any problems. Uh, I didn't train too hard, and uh, I have also, I think, uh, not too bad shape. I feel really ready to to race, and uh, I hope to improve my shape uh, for the the few for the next months will be important uh, for us in Belgium, but. Uh, we are focused on here first, and uh, I think it's a beautiful race to start the season. Uh, the panache and the daring that you have. I wonder, when you're racing, are you, uh, is, is the entertainment something that's in the back of your mind at all, or are you just uh, only concentrated and focused on the win? You know, uh, Does that make sense? I'm just curious how you <laughs> approach it with your mind. I think it's uh, a mix of the, the two reasons. Uh, you know, uh, I'm a little bit uh, an active person, and uh, yeah, it's it's uh, sometimes uh, boring uh, to to race. You know, so of course, I mean, uh, you need to to be uh, to have good legs to enjoy the race and to make some movement. But uh, this is also what uh, why I didn't really enjoy the last two years that uh, my shape was not. Uh, like I really want, and uh, I don't really uh, did what I uh, what I like on the bike. So, but uh, at the end, also, you always uh, try to win the race. So, in this way, sometimes uh, it was m more easy to to win the race when uh, I. Uh, 
I uh, attack or I don't know. Uh, because when you have to follow always and you, I don't know the word in English, to, to subi, how do you say that? Bored. Get bored. No, you, yeah. it's not uh, like, for example, I want Milan San Remo, but it's the race I don't enjoy. <laughs> because <laughs> because it's one of my biggest victory, really. I, I was so happy to, to win um, the monument of uh, San Remo, but San Remo, it's a special race, uh, 300 kilometers, the breakaway go really early in the race, and after you, you do six hours, and you just have to think about the podio, you know? So, <laughs> I press also. But I mean, <laughs> you, you know what I mean? It's, uh, I don't say that uh, it's boring, but I mean, I enjoy more, more the race when, uh, when something happens and uh, like, for example, here we have a beautiful uh, week of racing uh, ahead of front of us, and uh, it's a short stage. That's good, and uh, like like uh, Swart say, a lot of things can happen with the the wind and the climb and the heat, and uh, I think this is really something that uh, make the cycling that I enjoy cycling. That uh, it's pure racing and. Uh, uh, this is what I like in cycling. It seemed in the crit, uh, when you're at the front, you seem to be smiling. When you're in the pack, you were, like you said, bored. Yeah, I, I did the first 10 lap behind, and I go directly in the front. <laughs>